Hey, Orange One here. So, uh, I actually tried to record a little bit the other day, and I actually had my mic muted, and so I decided to get rid of that co content, but I wanted to show you a few things. Um, I basically installed in Louie the... And <clears throat> installed the joint torsion racket and a bionic power storage thing. It looks like I actually gave him one with 250 power. I think that was a mistake. I think I didn't intend to do that. Um, but you probably also are noticing that he's got dis um, disabled arms. He, uh, in the auto dock, um, he failed an operation, which is a huge bummer because it injured three of his limbs and Luckily, the auto dock can splint that. So, yeah, that's those are splinted, but uh, still, not great, you know. So, I just kind of want to show you also in here. There, oh, the blood's gone. There was a little bit of blood on the floor, and we got this faulty offense defense CVM. It's not filthy, but it's definitely not clean either, you know. But yeah, we got that going. Unfortunately, he's not going to be in fighting condition for a while. The cow here is also still hurt. But um, I just wanted to take it out of its uh, cage so that it could... Uh, which one? Oh, we can get our cooking up to 9 and our survival up to 8. Maybe we should do our survival first because that'll help us get more CBMs. The cooking, we don't need to get it higher, really. Yeah, so I basically wanted to um, help these guys survive, maybe get some mutagen going, and um, harvest some Datura, I think. We also got a little bit more bionic power ourselves. I don't think I installed anything else. No, we got a UPS-powered uh, thing, so we can shoot our guns, I believe, using our UPS power. When we're done with this book, we'll go test that out on something. We'll go get our, our bolt launcher, or the butterfly, and use it on something. But we also have the ability to make napalm. Our Jane wants us to kill uh, the cow. So we can make napalm, but we can't use th uh, launchers or throwers. Uh, well enough yet, so I got a couple ideas. We could try and find some books, which is probably a good use of our time, or we could just uh, make like the spray can th flamethrower and try and level that up that way. I don't think that's a very good idea, and we could get our focus up nice and high, and next time we go fight some zombies, use that a little bit, you know? But I'm not really sure if that's, that's worth our time or not. We do also have... Um, that lab that we wanted to take care of, but there's a, I was looking up here, there's a library right there. I'm just gonna make a note there, because I did want to make my way up and over there. I don't think we're gonna do that in the state that we're currently in, I and mean, we could handle it, but I think we might want to just go get the Datura seeds for the, uh, what you want to call it? Yeah, you can actually, you can actually get a little bit of milk there. Uh, let's do that, and then I'm gonna milk the rest of that. And uh, we'll do that, and then we'll actually cook both of those milks. Is there er, not mill? Uh, uh, we got raw milk. We could make condensed milk. That's going to take forever. Just regular milk. Let's do that. Sure. And then if I've got that in my inventory, it'll be easy for us to consume it. Yep. Just got to consume it all. Thank you. Okay. So. I want to get the cow away because I don't think that they're good in a moving vehicle. And let's go drive to a field where we're going to get some Datura seeds for our... Uh, range of adrenaline. And I think we should also try and clear out some houses. I am a little bit nervous because our character is so tired. Um, I'm afraid that they're just going to like collapse. 
Oh wow, there's a large tactical backpack. Is that a new item? I don't recognize that. Can I go get that? What are the stats on that thing? That's pretty good, that wise. What's my, uh, my stuff like? And this is Encumbrance 3, which is pretty much nothing. We don't actually have a backpack on, but that might be a good one for us to have on uh, when we, we want one. I'm going to just dump it here for now, though, because it is filthy, and I'm not feeling like messing with that. And... Yeah, okay. Also, we're back to carrying our stomach of water around. You didn't notice. Yeah, we're just gonna avoid all of you guys. Is there gonna be Tatura seeds in that forest tile? I don't see it. I think our best bet's just going out into the field a little bit. Yeah, there's these ants. These, um... There's a little ant larva there. We need to just be careful of that. The tourist seeds are from like what a little red plant or something. I forgot exactly what they look like, but is that that's dandelions? Uh, that's not it, is it? I don't think it is. Grass lily. I am not seeing the Datura plants. It's strange. Let's just drive up in the field a little bit. Oh wow, look at that sudden change in tile. That's a little uh, ugly there. Is that one? Bluebell. Yeah, I didn't think it was. I thought they were like little red flowers or something. Chamomile. Oh, we can make chamomile tea. I'm sure a survivor wouldn't mind that. It's funny. I didn't know chamomile was in the game. That has to be something that you can harvest. They wouldn't do that to me, would they? But the Eng English in me needs to uh, needs to find out. And so let's go ahead and I'm gonna get the gun out. I suspect this is gonna make all the ants in the area come running towards me, but. Yeah, I just wanted to run out because I thought this guy was going to charge me. Chamomile. I can't harvest it? What? You're kidding me, right? How can I not harvest chamomile? Oh, is this it? Oh, that's a tulip. It. I am not seeing it. Is that it? That might be it. Poppy. What does Datura look like? Dandelion. Pretty sure this is another dandelion. Yeah, because it's not an item, I can't just control V it. Datura, that's what it is. Oh, it looks like the little bushes. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna walk over there because it wasn't too far. And I don't feel like driving over there. Are you actually attacking me? You're not. I think if I just give you a little wide berth, you'll, you and I will be okay. Where was that one? Is it this? That's the scourge. And now I can't seem to find what I was looking at just a little bit ago. Was it this? That's more spurge. Chamomile. God, this is confusing. I think it was over here more, maybe. Maybe I should just drive around. I think we should just drive around. Because I'm not seeing that turret anymore. Riveting stuff, I know. Survivor hunts for Datura seeds. Okay, that ant is definitely coming after me. What a meanie. 
We don't need to fight him, so what's the point, right? Okay, let's just get back on the move. I'm gonna just check each one of those bushes that I drive by. It looks like we got like some sort of worm thing right there. For these bushes. Not close, I wanna look. Chamomile. Chamomile. Is that it? I think this might be it. That's a spurge. Detura, right there. Okay. So we have some Detura here. Pull it down a little bit. Let's get these seeds. I did not realize it would be so hard to find these. My god. I got three seeds. Uh, get back in there. Yeah, I don't, don't want you getting hit by an acid ant. So let's look at our syringes. Range of adrenaline. Oh, I actually already have some Satura seeds. I don't have enough to make two, but I might as well make one. Um, stop crafting. Yes. What is it that I'm hearing being attacked? Okay, it's not right by me, so I think we're okay. Range adrenaline. Let's get that going. I really would like to have that as my get out of jail free card. Unless I'm hearing smashing, I'm gonna just let them do their thing down there. Yeah, don't put that on the ground. Get on your in person. And let's see if we can find some more. Actually, I'm gonna wear my gun so we don't just drop it. Because our character does that from time to time. Thinks his gun is like burning his hands. But to be fair, Nasha is completely insane, so you can't get too mad at him for that kind of stuff, you know? Can I just use the mouse? And oh, there's another deterred plant right there. Okay. See what I mean? Like, this is so worth it. Just a couple seeds. And I'll have enough for another... Um, which one call it? Oh, actually, we have a ton of Datura seeds. It looks like when you pick them, you pick up a lot. Um, fringe, adrenaline. Can I also like that a little bit? And we need oxidizing powder and bleach. Oh, right, we need to craft that. Anyway, so I think we need to go try and find some bleach. I think that's what our game is basically telling me right now. Uh, uh. Pretty happy with all that, going in that storage. Go ahead and we'll drive to... And we already cleared out this area, so let's just drive to like there. Pretty close to the anthill though, maybe we should not go there. I want to get to that library, so let's go up north and we'll do that, and then we'll kind of fight our way through there. I think. And we are dead tired, so maybe we should just sleep out here a little bit and then head in there when we're feeling a little bit more up to it. We'll get a little bit further from the epicenter of the ants, and then I'll consider sleeping because I am a little nervous about trying to go to sleep here. While we're out here, though, I am just going to check these. That what I'm looking for. Give a mile. Nope. What about this? Detura, there we go. Or Detura. And there's a lot of zombies there. Okay, good to know. I might go uh say hello. Okay, there's a corrosive zombie, I'm sure. Okay, um, what is this, a trailer park? They're all in the trailer park. I think we should go draw their attention. What is this over here? There's a couple motels and stuff. Okay, I am intrigued by that, but, uh, yeah, I kind of want to show off these CBMs. Let's just get a little bit, uh, a little bit closer to this group. 
I have used up a lot of my bullets to the point where I want to kind of slow it down just a little bit. Um, so, I mean, I will fire my gun, I think, to attract them. But I'm not going to use it for, like, everything. Okay, we're crouching. Let's go ahead and just close that because I definitely do not want my friend involved in this fight. I'll just take a couple steps down. I get the gun out. And I'm actually going to draw the Jane and just put the gun on the ground, I think. Just because I don't want it encumbering me for more. Well. Like, we can take out these dudes in melee, but... Uh, see, let's go enhanced memory. Thanks. Do that as well. And joint servos. We'll, we'll do that as, as it's needed. I don't think we're going to need it right away. But we might need it to get away from some of these dogs. Okay. Yeah, the dogs are going to be annoying. Okay, yeah, we are going to want joint servo on. And we're just going to run a little bit. See what I mean? That helps me get a little bit of distance between me and them. And then I can melee them. Can melee the doggos, no problem. Okay, it's very sweet. Okay. We're just able to outrun dogs, guys. I don't know if you uh, really are taking that in, but we just outran a pack of dogs and swung at them and killed them. Like, no problem. I love that CBM. That is a good CBM. Uh, let's just keep that on our person. If we have the storage, we might as well. Hunting dog, I think you're going to make me all sad because I'm going to get boomered on and get all gross. Um, because of that, I might see about getting... Oh. Uh, yeah, I do have my bolt driver on me. Yeah, go ahead and get that out. We'll just let it get all the way up close and then we'll get a headshot and that should kill it. I just don't want to hurt my health. Oh, it actually exploded. It didn't actually explode on us. Okay. Go ahead and get that Jane back out. I don't think we really need to be using our ranged weapons right now. Oh, is there another one that's gonna go boom? Yeah, he's gonna go boom. Go ahead and run your joint servos. And we'll get a little bit more distance. Okay, now we did get boomered. Uh, we'll go like there. Okay, that looks good to me. Start walking. There's a, oh man, there's a juggernaut. Okay, well, we're gonna definitely need our gun then for that one. Let's just pull them down a little bit further away from the others because I think, I think we can take the, that group that's right there, but we are out of breath a little bit. So I'm gonna just have my joint servos on because. I just want to get some distance between you and me. Because if you punch, it's going to really hurt. Get more distance. Okay, that's a couple in. A little bit further. See what I mean? Anything's possible. As long as you have a little bit of stamina. Speaking of which, let's just catch our breath, and then we'll go back to the car. Oh, Hellhound, stop, stop catching breath. Yeah, oh god. Um, joint servo's still on. Can I shoot it from here? If it lets me, I'll, I'll shoot it, even if it's not a great shot, because it's gonna um, create issues for us. Okay, it died. Good. 
just gonna walk a little bit. Oh no, there, it, there's another one. Okay, just get some more distance. Unless there's a necromancer, there might be a necromancer that just revived you. That's another possibility. And I will definitely kill that before it hits. Okay. No necromancer as far as I can see. Okay. Looks good to me. Go ahead and drop that. Uh, you are a Rottweiler, so... We're about to get boomered again, though. I think if I put on the mask, that will protect against the boomer effects, but I am unsure. Is that a different skeletal juggernaut? Uh, go ahead, get that. Uh, and if you want to take off that mask, that would also be a good idea. Okay, we're gonna have to use up this whole magazine on this guy, I think, and probably the rest of our, our other one. Okay, this guy is mostly down, but as we said earlier, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to use up everything from this clip. Awesome. Uh, sure, use that. Oh geez, he almost punched me there because I grabbed my magazine. Okay, he is pretty much down. Get some more distance. Sure. There we go. Now he's down. Stop smashing, sure. Is this one I do want to shoot? I don't want to melee fight you. Now we need to just avoid other zombies and get back to our car. Get more bullets. And I just am realizing that we did not um, close the window for our friend. Okay, definitely those hellhounds need to go. I think that's all of them. Uh, ba -ba. Oh, there's a few more zombies that are coming our way. Hunting dog is pretty far away. Okay, go ahead and get the Jane out. And yeah, sure, I'll let, I'll let you wear the gun. It's gonna make it so this fight is a little bit tougher. I think we're okay. And we can probably turn off the joint servos now. Okay, and that thing's gonna grab me. He is super annoying. He just wrecked a couple of my gear. They're pretty bad, actually, too. That was, that was awful. Okay, so those guys are kind of taken care of for now. I'm gonna just repair our gear because it is actually pretty beat up right now. Healering. Where are you? There you are. I think I've got rags in here, right? Pretty sure I do. Repair. No, I do not. I think I have sheets. Tell me I got like a sheet. That's weird. I could have sworn that we had like a sheet or some rags in here. Okay, well, I can easily get some. This building is going to have sheets right here in the windows. So let's see, we might as well grab the long string as well. Yeah, we'll do like that. The zombies seem interested to go where we were shooting from. I think they're just following the sound, to be honest. Um, but you know what it was? It was I had some sheets the other place that we were at. Um, a little bit ago, but uh, I left it on the ground, like near like the doctor's office. I'm pretty sure. Okay, all the way until it's reinforced. We'll do that with all of our gear eventually. Uh, all the way till it's reinforced. Was that our gloves that? No, that's just some gloves that were in our 
are. I just... That was wasteful. I didn't need to do that. I uh, need leather patches for that. Okay. I put that sheet and some other stuff down in this area. Um, yeah, we'll do like that. Going into the car. And then we need to reload. Yeah, we've only got like 400 of our thousand boats that we had originally. So, yeah, we're going to need to think about doing things a little differently. <clears throat> Combat wise, either that or we could craft a ton of bullets, like try and go for gun stores and then craft from there. Okay, I feel like we we were looking for bleach. I don't think, I don't know if the trailer park spawns bleach or not. And only one way to find out, right? We'll get nice and close and we'll, we'll check it out. We'll leave some of those rags because we have our sheet. So there's a zombie nadir. Okay. I'm going to just bring the car around here. And then we'll check out the trailer park a little more. Yeah, let's, uh, let's close the window though. That I definitely think is going to be important because these zombies will see our friend otherwise. Are you a hunting dog? You are. You're about to boomer me. I really don't like when these guys go off, but I think if you're just on the edge, it's relatively okay. It is a nadir right there, which makes me a little nervous because they're pretty tough. Uh... Yeah, that's a super weird one. I think I'm gonna charge in. Take out Ladago. And I'm not really sure how many zombies are around here, and I'm trying to conserve bullets, so I'm gonna pull the Nadir over here a little bit. Just because we know there's the zombies north of us. And I think I can manage these two in melee. Yeah. Uh, looks like this is one that can do reach attacks. Okay, I cannot seem to hit him. This is an annoying enemy to do melee against. We really should be ranging you. Pretty much good though. There we go. Go ahead and get our mask on. That smoker is coming our way. And then I'll just melee. Yeah. Oh, actually, stop. Stop smashing. Yeah, I thought we, thought we killed him already. Kablam. Not sure where that Kablam's coming from. Go ahead and take off the mask, though. We're okay. That sounds bad. Yeah, so Louis. I think you're right. We might be in a bit of a sticky situation because now we got zombies coming from multiple directions, including a shocker brute. Um. Huh. Well, you're getting near to half an hour. I think we'll probably end this here, and I'll have to assess how I'm gonna deal with this because we got smokers and that that brute up there. I think we're probably just going to want to run away from the brute and shoot them. We could probably just shoot all of these guys, to be honest. There's a shocker. I don't want to be messing around. Hey, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.